The, the body responds very well to certain stressors. They're called hormesis or hormetic stressors. So cold plunging, for example, is a hormetic stress, but your body responds very well to it. So if you don't load up your bones, they don't strengthen. If you don't tear a muscle, it doesn't grow. If you don't challenge the immune system, it weakens. So what you saw was the global effect of weakening, the weakening of the immune system. We basically shoved everybody indoors, took human beings out of contact with other human beings, and we weakened the immune system. And then what happened on the backs of the pandemic? Oh, monkeypox. Well, what the hell is monkeypox? I don't know. I've never heard of monkeypox. No, it's always been around. It's just such a weak virus. We never thought about it. And now it's infecting people and bird flus and all of these different strains. We're on an eighth version of Omicron, the first, uh, you know, the, the mm -hmm. SARS mutation. So the best thing that could have happened to you during COVID was to get a natural infection and develop a natural immune response, right? Uh, so, um, so we're realizing that the more human beings are in contact with other human beings, the stronger our immune system is. Um, just like the more you load your bones, the stronger your bones. The more you challenge and you know uh, tear your muscles, muscle hypertrophy, you know, muscle hyperplasia, the, the stronger you become. That's why I believe that aging is the aggressive pursuit of comfort. And so many of us are we are aggressively pursuing comfort. We regulate our body temperature. I mean, our, our air temperature. We re regulate all of our lighting. You guys can make it the surface of the sun at one o'clock in the morning in here if you want it, right? That's not natural. So what happens is we, we get so accustomed at wanting to be comfortable that we actually accelerate our age. The reason why most people don't do cold showers or cold plunges is they don't like to be uncomfortable.